Hi everyone, I'm Aditi and soon in a few days I'm going to be finishing my journey here at the Purpose Academy which really breaks my heart because I honestly had the best two months. I did not think I would be spending my entire summer sitting in front of a computer having business theory sessions but I am so glad that I was selected for the academy because this journey has been such a roller coaster and I've learned so much. At the beginning of the program, I was just someone with no entrepreneurship or business knowledge. And to be honest, I was just looking for a way to fill up my free time. Something to do over the summer, something that would look good on college applications. But this is so much more than what I would have expected. While interviewing for a place in the Purpose Academy and after talking to Manav, when I realized that I could actually use this program to make a change in the lives of women all over India, I was so excited. The problem that we were faced with was women entrepreneurs in India. Now, it's no secret that in India, gender equality is a long road ahead. But while doing research, my team and I found out some alarming statistics about women in India. It ranks 52nd out of 58 countries on the Index of Women Entrepreneurs and only 14% of the 58 million entrepreneurs in India are women. The reason behind this is the cultural bias that exists in the patriarchal society that we live in. Especially in rural areas, the mental models of all the people are that women are supposed to take care of the family while the men should be the main source of income. After I deep dive into this wicked problem, we were given the golden opportunity to partner up with an organization called Mitti Kirang. They're a social venture which provides an e-commerce platform to women entrepreneurs all over India and gives them a medium to sell their handmade and organic products. Our multiple conversations with the women beneficiaries from Mitti Kirang revealed that their biggest problem was getting visibility and outreach on social media and garnering new customer traffic on their website. Now, coming to our solution design. Our weekly presentations with Mark on what we learned throughout the week and what we plan to do next was one of our pivoting points for our solution. We focus on the functionality and the deliverability that we could provide to these women. Since their main problem was outreach, we decided to amplify their posts on social media. We've also launched a fundraiser under the name Project Saksham, Saksham meaning capability. We want to provide these women entrepreneurs with the same opportunities that men get, and we hope to raise about 4 lakh Indian rupees. Now, my journey at the TPA, it wasn't always smooth sailing. We did have our bumps, we did have our obstacles. But as a team, and with the help of our mentors, we were able to overcome them. I've genuinely learned how to work in a team, and my companionship with Akul, Neeral, and Sahani has only grown over the past two months. If I'm being honest, at the beginning of the program, I would have probably thought to myself, eh, I could do that on my own, or I could handle this presentation, but I've learned that it's good to listen to other people's opinions. Continue your conversations with yes and instead of no but. Listen to other people's ideas. I think the key takeaway from this program is that, yeah, wicked problems and social problems are difficult and not easy to solve, but they're also not hard enough for people to look at them and just say, that'll never be solved, why bother even trying? I really do hope that the money we raise is able to fund women entrepreneurs all over India and that soon enough women in business will be given as much recognition as the men in this country. So I'd just like to conclude by saying a big thank you to the Purpose Academy and the 1M1B organization for giving me such an amazing opportunity to work with such intelligent students. I will never forget this and I know that everything that I've learned in the past two months, I will definitely use in my future. So thank you so much.